everyone, it's Amanda Politano. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, make sure to subscribe and turn on my post notifications so that you don't miss an upload. A lot of you guys have also been telling me that none of my videos are ever in your subscription boxes. So definitely make sure that you turn on your post notifications if so, because apparently YouTube hates me. So. <laughs> I'm so excited for today's video. Yesterday I went over to Sephora and I picked up the entire collection of Rare Beauty, which is Selena Gomez's new makeup line. I am so, so excited to try this out. Obviously not sponsored. I was not on the PR list. Went to Sephora, bought this shit myself. I genuinely just like really wanted to try it out. I'm gonna give you guys my honest opinion on everything. So it's gonna be a full face of Rare Beauty. Before we get started, I just wanna say I love Selena Gomez. I just look up to her her a lot and she's just like a great role model I think to young girls and I just love the message that she spreads and everything like that I have loved her ever since Wizards of Waverly Place my password for everything used to be Alex 500 it's not anymore so it's all right but like I remember in elementary school like that was my password for my computer so I don't know she's such an inspiration everything she does is so classy and she's just such an amazing person and I love her so I'm I'm really excited to try this out and I'm proud of her so yay okay I'm gonna first show you guys everything that I picked up and then we're gonna just get started first thing I got the liquid touch weightless foundation I got the shade 250w it was a little hard to pick my shade because you can't actually like test anything in Sephora right now because of COVID so then I got the illuminating primer which I'm excited about I got the liquid illuminizer in the shade flaunt the Brow Harmony Crayon and Gel in Cool Brown. I got the Liquid Liner in Black, the Concealer in 240W. So I went a shade lighter just so that it could be a little bit more like brightening and whatnot. And then lastly, I got the Liquid Blush and I got the shade Bliss, super pretty. And then I got this lip balm in the shade Praise. So I'm so excited to try all of this and let's get started. All right, so first things first, let's go in with the illuminating primer all the packaging is so like sleek and stuff I like it a lot I love the name of the brand as well this is the primer super tiny which is like the first thing I noticed I don't know if it comes in a bigger size or if it's just this but yeah it's definitely really really small but I like the packaging a lot oh it's like kind of like a pearl color definitely really illuminating i could already tell that this is gonna look really pretty underneath the foundation so off the bat i really like how they made my skin feel and look i feel like i look very glowy which you guys know i love looking glowy so i like that a lot very nice selena imagine if she watched this I would honestly cry. Next up, I'm gonna go in with the foundation. I never really wear foundation. I'm more of just like a concealer girl, but I'm excited to try this. Um, obviously I've like seen videos and stuff, so I know what everything looks like, but I love the packaging. Like, I think it's just so cute, this little ball thing. I've never ha used a foundation that has like a applicator like this, but it seems very convenient. This actually is super convenient. It feels very light, which I like. Cause as I said, I never really wear foundation. So if I do wear a foundation, I like it to be a lighter one. I feel like this is a good match for my skin. I really like how it feels. Also pricing, everything was honestly like really reasonably priced, I think. I got all of these products, which is basically a full face worth of the makeup. And it came to 176, which is obviously like expensive, but not too bad for a full face worth of makeup. Yeah, it like sits on my skin really nice and just looks super dewy. I don't know if that is the foundation or the primer that's making it so dewy, but I love the way that it looks. Like I love the two products together. Now let's move on to the concealer. Again, I got this in shade 240 W and the foundation in 250. And also she has a ton of shades, which is obviously great. This is like a triangular applicator, which you never really see, but I mean, cute. 
I think that I did good picking the shades. I was a little nervous. I really like this concealer. It's covering up my dark circles, which aren't that dark to be honest. So not really that hard to do. I like it though. It's like brightening up the under eye, the shade that I chose, which is good. So I definitely did good color matching, which I'm proud of myself for. If you guys have tried out this line, let me know what your favorite product is. Oh, next I'm gonna do my own cream contour, which I use the Fenty Beauty one just because she didn't have any like bronzer or anything. So I'm just gonna do that because y'all know I can't not. Now I'm going to try the liquid blush. Super excited about this because I've heard amazing things about it. I know that she said in her video with Nikki Tutorials that a little bit goes a long way with this stuff. So I'm going to put a little bit. I just did two little dots on each cheek. I feel like that should be a good amount. This color is so pretty. Again, this is in the shade Bliss. I think it's so gorgeous. I know that there's a more orangey shade that she said is her favorite and that's the one I wanted to get, but it was sold out. Of course it was because she said it was her favorite, so. Wow, this is like super like moussey. Like it feels very, like it's, like I don't know how to explain it. It's very, very easy to blend. That's something I really like. All of the products that I've put on all blend together like super, seamlessly which is always really really good blush has been like everything i've been loving blush lately all right next up let's try out the liquid illuminizer i got this in the shade flaunt which is a more like bronzy shade so hopefully it's not too dark for me this is what it looks like i love all these like doe fit applicators is that what they're called i don't know so i put a little bit on right there let's blend it I'm gonna blend it like up. Ooh, I love the shade that I picked. I'm really happy that I picked the one that I did. I like how natural all of this stuff looks and it just like makes for a very like dewy glowy look. Wow, that's so pretty. And that again, blends in so nice. Wow, I'm honestly kind of surprised because I feel like I love Selena so much. You never like want to think that like people would just put their name on something but like for celebrities that's like always something that comes into your head I feel like especially for like the makeup industry that they just like slap their name on something and don't really actually care about the product. I feel like you would think that a lot when it comes to celebrities but you can tell that these products like actually took time and she actually like put a lot into them because they actually are like very very good products and yeah I really 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 like this stuff. Also I feel like Selena is a very like natural girl like I feel like her makeup always is pretty natural so this line kind of like represents that well because it's not like anything crazy and it all is like super natural and glowy and I feel like she always looks like very glowy and very natural and stuff so I like that wow my skin looks like really good right now I'm like obsessed with this stuff I'm not sure if she had a powder in her collection but I didn't see it so I'm just gonna be using my Laura Mercier one next I think I'm gonna do my eyebrows okay so I got the little brow crayon and gel in the shade cool brown i never really use brow pencils but let's give it a go i also don't fill my brows in like all that much oh i really liked that my eyebrow cuts off a little at the end and it literally just took me five seconds to fill that in and the shape of this is kind of like triangular and it was just so easy to finish off my eyebrow with the shape that it is. Wow, I really, really like this. Okay, Selena. I mean, I think my brows look good, so I'm just gonna blend out my eye because I feel like I have a little creasing. Next up, let's do eyeliner. I'm a little bit nervous because I want to do a little wing and I hope I don't mess up, but this is the eyeliner. I love the packaging of the eyeliner. I think it's so cute. It looks like a little pen and the top of it is like gold. I don't know if I love the wing I just did, but the eyeliner glides on so smooth. It's really, really easy to apply. Okay, my wings are completely different shapes. Okay, I think I like this one better. I'm gonna go off camera and fix this wing just because I suck at getting my wings even, but I really like this eyeliner. I'm definitely gonna continue using this. It's so easy to use and it glides on really, really nicely. So I really, really like it. Okay, I just fixed the wing and I love that eyeliner. Like, I'm gonna be using the eyeliner all the time. Definitely gonna be my new go-to. For the last product, we have the lip balm and I got it in the shade Praise. So it's like a tinted lip balm. So another super natural product. Ooh. 
super moisturizing and that color is so pretty okay oh I was like, why do I look literally naked? I don't have mascara on. So I don't think that she has a mascara in her collection either. So I'm just gonna use my Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk one. Honestly, she might, and I might've missed it. I love this mascara. So that is the finished look. I love how it turned out. I feel like my skin just looks so light and dewy and glowy and just like all the good things that you want it to look after putting makeup on. I love it so much. All right, my top three favorite products that we used today probably would have to be one, the eyeliner. I loved this stuff. It's amazing. It glides on so smooth and just looks bomb. I'm super excited about that. Probably the primer. I love how it it looks underneath the makeup. It just leaves your skin looking so, so glowy. It's beautiful. The last one, I'm gonna have to go with the blush. I just think that it's gorgeous. It blended in so amazingly. I love everything though. Like I genuinely think that everything is so great. I'm honestly surprised that I like everything. That's crazy, but I truly do. I'm not even just saying that. Like obviously this isn't sponsored or anything. I genuinely just really like these products. They're bomb and I don't know. I just feel really confident right now and I like the way I look. So that's always a good thing. But let me know if you guys want more makeup videos like this one. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all to the minute back and I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye.